Um, how's this Melbourne pastor that I saw yesterday on TV being a real, a real god botherer? Mm. Uh, he's defied coronavirus lockdown by holding a packed church service. What a hero. Telling police he's obeying God, not man. Oh, yawn. Christian Revival Church Pastor Paul Furlong was fined 1600 bucks and could face incitement charges for leading the service in the middle of Victoria's lockdown, and so he should. Against, We're all being compliant, yeah, as always. Against the law. But Can't not, be doing this. Not old, mate. No. Dozens of officers swarmed to the Narry Warren Church on Sunday morning following reports of a mass gathering with few masks and minimal physical distancing in place. What does it matter? Is religion is religion one of the essential four reasons why you can leave no. your house? No, it's not. No. The pastor confronted with officers in front of TV cameras uh, insisted the service wasn't a protest of lockdown restrictions. I guess the question is, do I obey God or do I obey man? Do I what? I guess the question is, do I obey God or do I obey man? Bay. I think the question is, can you say obey? Yes. And the answer clearly is no. no. Did God show you how to say obey? I guess the question is, do I obey God or do I obey man? So you're saying bay. I don't know what he's saying. Is he talking about Beyonce? I thought he was talking about Port <laughs> Phillip Bay. <laughs> he's talking about Beyonce on Port Phillip Bay. <laughs> Shut up, mate. Yeah, so confused. Pastor Furlong. Pastor is such an awful word, isn't it? Yeah. Pastor? I don't know why I have such an issue with the word pastor. What would you prefer? Oh, Fuseli. <laughs> Fuseli Furlong. The Marty Sheagold Show. Triple M.